So YouTube, we got a December, actually this is my fourth quarter 2016 edition of Motown Mail for my ComC.com pickups. Um, not a crazy huge stack, but this is what I got in the month of uh, October, November, December. So I usually do one shipment per quarter, so this is what I got in the last quarter of 2016. Not really any, any order, I got three cards here that apparently in my opinion deserved magnetics so we'll start off with those first uh, my first ever autograph of uh, all around great player uh, Kawhi Leonard this is a rookie auto hence the rookie card emblem right there this is from innovation really nice looking card with the Spurs cards being black and silver autograph being in black and silver so this card really appealed to me it's not numbered but still a really nice looking um, rookie auto of Kawhi Leonard so got that uh, next thing, this is fairly hard to find. It's a 2001 Donruss Signature Series Team Trademarks on card auto of Ernie Banks, numbered to a buck eighty. Now I got this card in, and I'm like, man, that's a really nice looking set. Love the colors in it. Um, but then I saw that pretty much all the other cards in the set are sticker autos, and see those ugly hologram type foil stickers and Ernie Banks for some reason is signed on the card and this is a really nice looking card right here love how that card looks really happy to add that to the collection uh, next a 1934 um, looks like Gaudi but it's actually a big league chewing gum card of former Cubs player and manager Charlie Grimm it's a nice original 1934 big league chewing gum card there so that's a pretty cool card. That was on my watch list for a long time on there, and I decided to finally pull the trigger on it. So I got that. Uh, Jaleel Okafor, rookie auto from Clear Vision, number to a buck nineteen. Former Duke star, playing for the 76ers now. Uh, autograph of Fred Beletnikoff, Hall of Fame uh, Raiders uh, player, number to 49. So it's very shiny. Uh, next, got this really cheap. It's a Sterling Bowman Sterling auto. Not sure what this parallel is, but it's numbered one of twenty-five of Marquise Lee, who actually was playing better than Allen Robinson. Now it's Allen Robinson was my second-round pick in fantasy this year, and he just sucked. Uh, Mike Gillisley, who is Lashawn McCoy's backup in Buffalo. This is a pretty nice-looking card from. Um, Tops Platinum, number to 1,000, so there's only 999 more of these out here. A uh, nice three-color patch of jersey he never wore uh, with a sticker auto, but still a nice colors on that, so got that for like a dollar fitty. Uh, next, I actually got this from Mike O. Um, does really great videos on here, very high-quality videos. Uh, does watch my videos, so what's up, Mike? Did get this from him. Um, he was having a, a sale on Comp C. Picked this up, my first autograph of Jameson Crowder. One, two, three, four, break three color patch of a jersey he never wore. Uh, rookie Auto, not numbered, still a nice looking card. Steve Smith, um, really cool looking card here from 2015-16, I'm sorry, 2013-14 Select. It's very sparkly, nice looking card. Sticker Auto, but still got that really cheap. A lot of these are really cheap. This is numbered to 99. Next, I got this for like a buck fifty. Eric Ebron, uh, Four pieces of jersey never wore, numbered to, not numbered, I don't think, nope. Uh, from Topps Prime, sticker auto, but got it dirt cheap. Got this for really cheap, it was like five bucks. This is one of the Yankees' top prospects. Uh, Blake Rutherford, and it looks like this is a, it doesn't say what it is, but it looks like it's a piece of uh, batting glove. That's kind of what that mark looks like, uh, in my opinion. Um, so pretty nice looking card here, numbered eight of 25, so. Really happy to get that for like five, five and a quarter, I think. I paid for that. So, really nice. I think that's probably at least a $35 card. So, really happy to get that, especially for the price. Thought I already, I thought I needed a Jonas Valanciunas autograph. And I already had one of his autographs, and I already had the exact same card. I think it's a different color piece jersey, but uh, got two of those now. Cy Young Award winner, Rick Porcello. Got this dirt cheap. Uh, Triple Threads Auto, number to 99. Matt Moore with the Giants now. On card auto from Museum Collection number to 399. This dude's a beast. Corey Kluber. 
uh, from Top Supreme, not numbered. I always think this little silhouette type thing looks like a dude with his eyebrows. I'm not sure. I don't think that's what they were going for, but that's what it looks like. Uh, Jay Ajayi, who I sucked in fantasy this year, but boy, this guy really picked me up a couple weeks. He had a two 200 yard rushing games in a row this year. Um, kind of fell off a little bit, I think, but uh, still got this really cheap right before stuff blew up. Uh, Donner Signature, it's a sticker auto, but it's it's hidden well in that little design there. Uh, big piece of fake jersey right there. Rookie auto from, I don't know what this is. I already said, uh, Panini Signature. So, cool looking card there. Uh, dude's on my fantasy basketball team. Um, was doing really well until he had a head injury. They didn't really specify what kind of head injury he had. Um, but TJ Warren, NC State card, again with the Phoenix Suns. Now this is number to 499. Uh, Charles Oakley, uh, this is a really nice, clean looking card right here. Um, immortalized autograph from Panini Intrigue, number to 299. Sent a TTM request to him to his car wash, I think in, I forgot where it was at, on the East Coast somewhere. Um, never got it back, so decided to pick this up. Nice looking card. I got this for, I think, less than a buck. Uh, Mirza Teletovic, uh, rookie auto from uh, Innovation. Uh, Dan Marley, or as when I was a kid, we used to call him Dan Majorly. So, uh, sticker auto. He, his Most of, I would say, 99% of his TTM returns are fake. So, I picked up this real one, number 10 of a buck 49 from Elite. Got this for, like, less than a buck. Joik Bell. Had that for a while. Uh, this kid's actually from my hometown. Uh, didn't start MMA. It's one of my rare MMA uh, autos. So what's up, David? What's up? Uh, what's up, Tom? What's up, Sicto? This kid's from uh, from my area, though. The same uh, city I was born in. So decided to pick that up. Didn't start fighting until a couple years ago. So rooting for that kid. Uh, number to 200. Corey Anderson. I should probably mention who that is. Corey Anderson. So I got that really cheap. Uh, another kid from the uh, city I grew up in, uh, Fred Van Vliet. He's kind of going in between the Raptors and the Raptors D-League team, uh, but really nice looking card. He was a beast at uh, Wichita State, so we're always rooting for him. Crappy auto, but it is what it is. Um, he's got a good story, too. Um, look it up if you got time. Fred Van Vliet auto. Uh, Landon Collins for the Minimo Landon PC. Uh, this kid's a pretty good, uh, pretty good football player. Uh, this is his season ticket college auto from his Bama days. So nice looking card there. First landing Collins autograph. Got this really cheap. Uh, Victor Caratini, Cubs catching prospect. Probably isn't gonna do much. Uh, Frankie Montes. Got that on card auto from Topps Chrome. This dude's got crazy case per nine. You guys know how I am about my case per nine in the uh, the low minor leagues. Always watching out for those guys. Thomas Zapuki. Um, sticker auto from Elite. Got that cheap. Uh, Nate Smith is actually uh, an autograph I just got from B-Mart, but I uh, already had bought this certified auto from Bowman Chrome. Uh, Dylan Cousins. Hey, I think he led the minor leagues in home runs last year. I think he eclipsed 40, or maybe it was 39 or something. His teammate, Reese Hoskins, was right with him. Uh, Dylan Cousins, sticker auto from Topps Pro Debut. Uh, Harold Ramirez got this really cheap. John Brown got this really cheap. He's like an all-or-nothing receiver for the Arizona Cardinals. Uh, Jordan Lynch, really cool card here from my NIU Huskies collection. NIU, right there. Uh, Jordan Lynch, Heisman uh, finalist. So that was always a that was a really cool season watching that and them going to the Orange Bowl and getting killed by Florida State. But it's all good. Got to the Orange Bowl. Uh, I got a Michael Sam autograph. First uh, pro football player to come out as gay uh, while playing. Hasn't didn't really do anything. I think he's actually playing Canadian football uh, in the CFL. But got that for like less than a buck. Uh, I got a DeMarcus Cousins, first autograph of DeMarcus Cousins, 39 of 49. Uh, Hoopla autograph. I got that really, really cheap compared to what they usually go for. Uh, a couple of golfers I'm not real familiar with, but I got them so cheap, why not? Justin Thomas and Daniel Berger from Goodwin Champions. Uh, first autograph of Hall of Famer Mitch Richmond. Love how this card looks from Noor. 
uh, numbered 16 of 49. Lastly, I was so pumped about this card. I bought this card when he was with the Spurs. Had a huge following. And I bought this for like a quarter of what they were going for. And I should have flipped it, but I kept it because how can you get rid of a Boban Marjanovic autograph? Dude is crazy. And then he got traded to the Pistons for nothing, and they never play him. He actually played, I think, 19 or 20 minutes a couple nights ago and grabbed like 20 boards. So if this kid plays, man, he's huge. He's seven foot three. And he's awesome. It's Boban. So Boban Marjanovic. So this is back down to pretty much what I bought it for. But it is what it is. That's it. I would like to thank you all for watching. And as always, please, please stay safe.